Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to uh, Xenoblade Chronicles, just as night fell. But a transport guide, make it send you to Aerith Sea in the flash of light. Are you ready to go? Uh, yeah. Is this really the only way up there? Surely there has to be another way. What is it? Friends jumping bull! <laughs> All go to Erith! Jump? In that? You're nuts, Furball! You have nothing to fear. This will take us to Erith Sea. Yeah, that seems fine to me. We've seen plenty of other things. Look, it, she's walking on water. It's fine. She looks like, I don't know, might as well. <clears throat> Come on. Get your butt over here, Ryan. Creepy. Also creepy. Okay. We get to save. That's fine with me. It's chapter 8 time. Aerith C. Alright, and there are uh, floating islands. Well, that's Who would have cool. thought Erith Sea was right on top of Ricky's village? Dive deep enough, you can reach their tree. Perhaps you should try. Mm, might do. I haven't decided yet. <laughs> I hope you can hold your breath for a long time. If it's a sea, probably, uh... Is something wrong? It's Aren't very you curious? blue up here. About why we're going to Prison Island, I mean. It is not common for Homs to visit this region. Huh? You may have good reason, but forgive me. I do not pry into other people's business. It's definitely bugging her, Shulk. <laughs> how, how dare you, you clown. It's okay, Melia. We're not strangers anymore. Why are we getting well, I... yellow... <sighs> sparkle you're things? Right. So then you'll listen to our story. Yes. Tell me why you are here. Basically, it all started when... Explains, explains, explains. Wait, you haven't said anything yet. I see. I had heard about the mech on assault on the lower regions, but did not know the situation was so grave. How did you hear about it? How lucky we are. Hey, what's that? Is that? You are looking at Prison Island. So that's Prison Island. Yes. I was expecting a more and straightforward that is the island. Capital, All right, where are the other nations that uh, the Empire rules over? It's not just me, right? A floating city is a bit weird. Oh, come on. We've seen plenty of weird things. Built with superior defenses in mind. Incredible. What technology makes this possible? Magic. I do not know, and I've never had the need to. You oh, that's not don't great. know. It doesn't freak you out. You can eat bread without knowing how to bake it. Makes sense to me. Eh. But you should still you know that it's baked, kind of enter thing. Prison Island. Okay. And made from, like, we you know, grain and stuff. We will travel to the capital first. And how do you expect us to get up there? Fly? Yeah. There is a transporter up ahead. We can use that. To fly. Right? Or is it going to teleport us? I mean, I suppose it may teleport us. 
We've been deep sea diving. Now we're gonna fly. This place gives me the creeps. Oh, come on. I guess we don't have a choice. Nope. Right. Onwards to the capital. Still. What is it, Dunban? It's a sight to behold. Those look like anti mechon defense systems. Boy, it'd be nice if we could get some of those down in uh, Colony 9. Latail Shore. Got lots of XP and stuff, uh, but first... Sparkly Bits. Oil Branch. Dolphin Carrot. Another Dolphin Carrot. Cruise Pagool. The enemy's weak! I was actually gonna take out uh, uh, Shulk and put in Dunbit. Okay, I mean, I guess you could do that. <laughs> Yeah, no, I am I am completely unsurprised that she is now uh, getting the uh, aggro. Okay, let's get going. I see your strength is the genuine article. Rotten meat. Rotten meat. Alright, so uh, skill trees, well, what do we get? Um Oh, alright. Um allows items to be sold for a higher price. Nice. Profit up, effect value at 20%. Haven't sold too much yet, so that's good. And XP bonus. Always awards the same XP regardless of participation in battle. Ricky C, Ricky do. All right, so that's triangle. There aren't any triangles. I guess that's just for everyone. Always active. I assume so. All right. I'll take that. Uh, I was going to put Dunban in so we get some more... Uh, affinity... around for more things to get. Yeah, it's just like raining uh, yellow stuff. No mercy! Let's knock this out nice and quick. I will give it my all, no matter the enemy. All right, so let's see. After Gale Slash, what do I have Gale Slash? There's Gale Slash. There we go. Scratched Jewel. Aerith Hiln. No mercy. Nope. Where was it? No mercy. Okay. Let's sort this out nice and quickly. I will give it my all, no matter the enemy. There we go. Gotcha. Covert stance. Victory is ours. We make a great team. Let us remain vigilant. Jagged tail. Okay. Uh, yeah, there's a there's a lot that we can go sailing around. I guess swimming around, not sailing. 
I'm not sure that I want to try this just yet. Lunar Grady. There we go. I have no idea what any of these do. Chance of delivering a combo attack, huh? Right. Gonna armor down. There we go. More rotten meat. More rotten meat. I guess that's just what we find around here. All right. Let's look for more sparkly bits. Getting some affinity change. Blono Nebula. I don't think we need to uh, do anything with that right now. Let's try going under this thing and see what we see on the other side. That looks like coral. Yep. So apparently we have a uh, non-aquatic coral. Actually, that's a pretty interesting idea. I wonder what coral might be like if it could uh, evolve to not be aquatic. All right. Um, I don't feel like I want to just swim around here right now. I may do that uh, on my own, like off camera, just to try and find different areas and stuff like that. But it looks very, very big here, so. It is probably a good idea to uh, pop up and teleport. We may get some sort of, uh, like the Imperial Capital may have, uh, like, a transport system to take us to uh, other places. Despair Clover. Dilemma Rock. More Despair Clover. Seaberry. I needed one of those. Well, I needed multiple of those, actually. Should also make it daytime. See what this place looks like then. Not seeing any more sparkly bits, unfortunately. Which, considering what we've got going on here, uh... Yeah, let's change time. There we go. <laughs> now we have seagulls. Can't jump on the coral. No, nope, I can't. On some of the coral, at least. All right, before we uh, go on there, let's get Shulk in, just so that, uh... Eh, he'll probably pop out if things come up. Uh, but we did get some collectibles, so... Wikipedia. All right, Dolphin Carrot. Cute little vegetable, but eating it turns your tongue orange for weeks. Uh, sea Berry. An enormous white flower. Reminds you of a snowy scene when open. Despair Clover, flower with thermal properties, carry it around to keep you warm. Sea Frog, resides in warm climes, has a voracious appetite for fish. 
oil branch. A branch with oily sap. Your hands get all greasy just from touching it. Ew. Dilemma rock. A strange stone used for building. Looks hard, but is it's actually soft. High violet. Melia named this instinctively. A staff that gathers harmful energy. Okay. All right. Hovering Reef 1. Yeah, that's kind of what I expected. We'd have some uh, teleporter thingies. You know what? Not doing a whole lot of damage, but there we go. Okay, let's get going, but we cannot be reckless. Uh, shell gauntlets, large Uranus crystal, and a squall element. All right. There we go. A high violet. Nothing there. All right, there is a teleporter there. That is not the one that we want to go down to at the moment. Flobble Andos, huh? Is this a Mechon? No, mercy. no okay. it's not. All right, nice it's just quick. a robot. There we go. Okay, let's get going. I see your sturdy armor. That's the sixth piece of sturdy armor we need. Let's take them, them to Ruthen. He can make the deciphering machine. Um. <laughs> I like how that that. It, it's it's like the game doesn't even care that someone else is in the lead. It's just yeah, no, I'm just gonna. Go with the uh, other one. All right. Uh, let's go through here. See where this takes us. There we go. Showdown cliff. Radish. Main cat. Oil branch. Doomsday a poppy. Oh, we got hoads. Sea berry. And Orlugas. They don't really care about me. So I'm too high level. <laughs> yep, 
It's another white tail. They both really fluffy. Ricky want to use them as pillows. We take them back and sleep. Okay. Wind ether deposits. Pretty wind crystals. All right. So not a whole lot here. I'll leave these guys alone for the moment. We can just go down this way. So it doesn't look like there's a way up from the water up here, so that's uh, a little annoying. See where this takes us. Hovering Reef 2, skill learned. We can easily jump off this area. We got more hoads. There at the Ansel. We got a road up here, but. That's the uh, hovering reef. That'll take us somewhere else. That lemma rock. Uh, what did we pick up since then? Tropical radish. Uh, reveals a tropical color when you brush off the inky black clay. Sweet. Doomsday poppy. Grows in clusters near water. Everyone adores its purple petals. Main cat. A very regal looking cat. It has lovely smooth paw pads. Aerial cloak too. And a white tail. A sapling like a fox's, a white fox's tail. Used as bedding for small animals. All right, this is not where we're supposed to go, so let's take it first. Here we go. Hovering Reef 3. Game's like, no, 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 go the other way. Got a white tail. Steel. Queen. We're going to Aluka, or Flobble Andoses. takes me. Hovering Reef 4. Alright, night time is coming. A sea berry. Zerith Lighthouse, Tropical Radish. White Tail. Oil Branch. Can we go in here right now? Kind of guessing the answer is going to be no, but we'll see. can. Is there anything to do in here? Yes, there is. Ooh. 
very impressive. Can't view this heart to heart yet. All right. There are definitely areas down there. Definitely have a uh, temptation to like leap off from up there, but I will hold off on that for now. Nighttime. Is nighttime the right time for collecting items? Maybe. Razor Teasel. Teasel? Teasel? I don't know. Uh, so you got Sustained Spirit. Increases Aura Time. Effect value 10. Alright. Uh, reduces the effects of Spike Attacks. That's uh, one thing that I was going for. Guessing that that island is someplace that'll have at least some interesting things going on. Whether it's just monsters or side quests or something like that. just take forever to swim everywhere, I would do that. Pink asparagus. Alright, pink asparagus. So hot you'll think there's been an explosion in your mouth. Razor teasel. Admits exotic sounds. Puts you in a really good mood. Steel hoin. Ryan boldly named this purple item that is both a gemstone and steel. Ether up three. I'll take that. Okay, that looks like some place to uh, fall down and explore at some point. Dilemma Rock. Is a Dilemma Rock when you're stuck between a rock and a hard place? Hovering Reef 6. Malaysia Cromar. I have no idea what you are. No mercy. Okay. Let's sort this out nice and quickly. I will give it my all. No matter the enemy. Steel strike. I'm on that man. Dodge trick. Let's go. The ether is blowing through me. Over here, slow coke. Gala. Oh, no less than that. I think we can do it. There we go. What do we get? Chipped Talon. Alright. You guys are guarding that way. Not that it makes much difference to me. There's another Dilemma Rock. Alright. Oh, missed that one. Razor Teasel. Yeah, you guys are going to let me through because I'm higher level, I know. <laughs> and some affinity changes. All right, let's see where this goes. Ether crystal deposit. Ah, oh, nice. Quite a few.
few of them. Uh, I need to get back there. Oh, I think that's where uh, Story is it wanted us to advance anyway, so and I need to take that one as well. Pretty electric crystals. There we go. I'll do some off-screen uh, gem combining as well. I think I read that Ricky and Melia are pretty good together, but... <coughs> Not sure. Need to go back and look that up. Is there one over here? No, there wasn't. There's no other way off there. Let's take this one back before we uh, do that. Might be something interesting down there in the middle. But, uh, all right, so the lighthouse has a teleport point. Well, that's actually good. Then let's go, let's fall down, because that's on the way back. If it's awful down there, we'll just zip on out. Uh, there we go, pink asparagus. Whee! Oh, hi. <laughs> Let's get up here a bit. Alright, so let's see how uh, difficult this is. It's a dragon-like thing with uh, horns on the I I don't know. Lexus Beard, Old Dragon Spine. Huh. Well, we got some X. Barrier. Bloody head charge, all right, as you, uh, wish. Oh, jeez. Go ahead and get you back up. Now, 
There we go. I see your strength is the genuine article. All right, silver X plate, Saint Rod shell gauntlets. All right, so these uh, these enemies they're a little annoying. Got something over here, and then I think we'll teleport because uh, we don't need to be here. I don't think. I was hoping there'd be something really interesting down here, and it doesn't seem like there is. Looks like the only way in is from above, however. So let's get back over here. Let's go this way, see what we got. No new collectibles. Alright, I'm guessing this is not going to take me anywhere. It appears to be broken, yep. Alright. So that one is broken. It leads somewhere, but that will probably be... Uh made available later through the story darn you plot walls how dare you exist Grab that white tail. Uh. Don't fall off. Guess we'll finally go the proper way. Episode's running a little bit long, but we'll, uh, we'll wrap it up when we get to another, like, uh, stopping point, like, uh, another point where we can teleport to. Goodies. And it's daytime. Haven't been paying as much attention. I did get something new, though. Uh, gold burdock. Uh, cook longer for extra sweetness and the eponymous golden color. Critical up two. I'll take that. Thank you. Two more things that I need to get. All right. But first. All right. We need a higher affinity between Ricky and Sharla. All right. Let's get to know. Center gate. I do not see a teleport point here, though. Well, that's uh, hitting us with some story. I guess we'll see what happens. Hello. Who are these guys? They got helmets on. Are those Kinda wings like on their head? Birds. It might be on their helmets. Hyantia. Welcome home, Lady Melia. 
Lady. Huh? You didn't realize that, Dunban? Thank you, Captain. These Homs and this Nopon are my guests. See them safely to the guest quarters. Give them anything they need. As Wait, you wish. You're leaving the part. Dang What's it! What's going on? I have no idea. Don't you dare leave the party, Melia. Melia, are you? Melia. I cannot speak now, but I shall fulfill my promise. I understand. I will arrange for an audience with the Emperor. Will well, that's wait? nice. Sure. We won't move an inch. Trust me. My thanks. Uh, so who, who's going to guide Lady us? Melia, he says. Shulk. You thinking the same as me? Maybe. Whatever her position is here, Melia won't let us down. I'm sure you're right. <gasps> More of these guys. Uh, they're armed. Hi? Wasn't expecting them to be armed. I must report the Telethia's defeat to His Majesty and request entry to Prison Island. Shulk is depending on me. I must hurry to the audience chamber. Game, I kind of expected that. Like, uh, <laughs> you didn't need the internal uh, dialogue, but okay. Uh, main menu. Can I save? No, I can't save. Okay. Well, landmark main entrance. Well, I did want to get to a place that I could teleport to, and now I can save. <laughs> All right. Well, I was gonna do some gem crafting. I guess maybe I'll do another episode. <laughs> okay. Well, when we come back next time, I guess Melia has to go uh, report to Her Majesty, which is totally not gonna be her father. No, definitely not. No. Why, why would we have the daughter of the Emperor with? right? Of course we do. Anyway, that will be for next time. See you then, everyone.